Hello guys, this is the third part of uh, the map view. Uh, okay, last time we stopped here. Okay, so this is where we stopped. We were able to be print to print our uh, our location, and that's all. So in this video, before we get to the API, we have to be able to create to create pins because for the route to be uh, to be initiated, we need two points: starting point and an ending point. Okay, so to create that, we need to we need uh, to create two buttons, one for uh, place and one for remove. So let's start with place. Okay, so place, pin. Okay, this way, and uh, let's give it a size. So root dot width 0.3 and root dot height of 0.0. 0.5 okay and let's say position is 00 okay and there is a compress press let's say root dot place pin okay this way and uh, let's copy this and paste it here and just Say here remove and in this we have to give it uh, a different position so root dot width of 0 0.7 okay and uh, in here we have to call it remove okay so we come here we define we define uh, place pin okay it takes self we pass for now and let's just copy this and come here paste it okay and replace the place with the remove let's see if it works okay we have two points oh, we have two buttons okay and uh, now we're gonna be needing uh, something uh, that is called that is called uh, get uh, get uh, what and long get lot I think get lot long at so what we're gonna do is uh, okay let me show you so we want to be when we click here we have to be able to come here in the map view and when we click we get the latitude and longitude of the touch X and the touch Y okay so whenever we touch here or here or here it's gonna be translated to latitude and longitude okay guys so for this we need to use this function on the self ids dot main map okay and let's uh, let me just uh let us just print this to show you what i'm trying to do okay at uh okay we need a function first up we need a function first let's call it on touch up and why we need the touch dot uh, on touch up because on touch down is going to be interfering with our map view okay so on touch on touch up come on i cannot type it takes self and also touch okay so we come here and say uh let's say self dot ids dot main map and say get lat long at okay lat long okay so uh, let's say touch x and touch dot y okay let me see if i can print this okay before we get to it okay there's something wrong okay touch 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 okay it's pretty simple so whenever we click we get in the latitude and longitude okay so but we have to ignore this space so whenever we click on the button we don't we don't want to create a pin when when we uh when we click on our button so this is an on press and also an auto an on charge okay so we have to ignore this space here okay to ignore that space we have to do something like this so self uh, or a condition if self dot uh, let's say uh, let's say not this way let's say touch dot y Okay, so touch that y. Okay, is 
bigger than, let's say, greater than, uh, let's say, self dot width uh, or self dot height of the height of this button. Okay, of these two buttons. So, of, uh, so it's gonna be multiplied by the size. Okay, of that button. So, so if we're not here, we're gonna be able to to print. Okay, so if you click on place pin. We're not gonna be printing anything. Okay, guys this space this whole space okay uh, that's all guys so let's continue okay so we have to add to be able to add to add a marker profile so let's define it let's say self dot let's call it destination so this for short okay and not marker profile okay this way it takes lot okay and it takes long okay so long this way it takes source equals to as you can see i'm using this red dot instead of the black one for destination so this dot png okay and for the latitude and longitude it's a it's a list so we have to use this index zero index and the one index okay so let's say lat is as uh let's copy copy this come here paste here and also be able to add this to add this okay oh let me just uh increase this width okay and for the longitude it's the same but one here okay i think i think that's all so we need to add the widget all right so self dot ids dot say main map okay and add widget okay and the self dot list okay i don't know if it works or not okay it works but now we are creating too much and we need to decrease that for this we need uh we need to use this place pin remove pin okay so place pin let's initiate two conditions uh, i think they are initiated here okay i've been working with this i guess so let's uh let's say let's say when we click on the set on the place pin we're gonna say we're gonna say placed it's true okay this way and uh come here and uh we say itself dot placed is equal to uh is equal to true this way and to ignore to ignore multiple multiple uh, multiple pins we have to do this and self dot exists equals to false this way okay and we come here we do uh, if we create the pin we need to do this exists equals to, to true and if we want to remove the pin, we simply do this. If the pin exists, of course, if self dot exists equals to true, then we come here, we do self ids dot main map dot remove, let's say uh, remove widget, okay. Remove widget, and we call it self dot this, okay. I think I think that's all and of course we have to do this cell dot placed equals to false and also cell dot exists equals to false okay let's try it and see if it works I hope so okay it works okay now I want to add the button to this pin like this one okay not rounded but like this one okay so i come here i add a button here so let's define a button first so self dot btn equals to let's say uh button okay and that button has uh, has a text okay that text let's say print uh, location or something like that and uh, let's give it an press so press 
press is equals to we have to define a function let's call it solve press uh, maybe this okay and we have to add this button to the widget so self dot this we have to add it to the pin so the self dot this dot add the widget and then self dot btn and we have to know we have to remember this so we have to come here and do this so def dot def uh, we call it press okay press this then self then instance because we are using uh, we are creating the button here instance then then we come here we do print let's say uh self dot this dot uh, latitude and uh, let's create another line of print which is not healthy okay and uh, be able to paste this and uh, and print the longitude okay let's see if this works did we add the widget yes we added it so base print come here click on it and let's see if we are truly printing or not i think that we are yes we are okay so the next video we're going to create roots okay guys so we're gonna we're gonna use the app the api you're going to be talking about it I hope you enjoyed the video and uh, I hope you can, you can subscribe to my channel if you didn't and uh, see you next time.